If you're pierced with a labray, specifically in your cartilage, and you're unsure of how to take it out or put it in, then this video is for you. So a labray is a specific type of earring. It can be used in several different piercings, but this one we're going to be talking about our cartilage. Um, it has a flat back, so it makes it very comfortable to sleep in. It is a little bit thicker than a regular earring. They range anywhere between 16 to uh, the biggest I've seen is a 19 gauge, and the top piece is actually what screws on and off. There are some out there called push pins that pull on and off, but today we're going to be talking about the ones that screw on and off. I will be showing you how to remove it and how to put it in. This is an updated video from a video that I did in like 2019. When I look back on that video, I'm just like, eh, it's definitely time to redo this video uh, to make it more helpful. Normally, I wear a hoop in my cartilage. These ones are from Banter. I will leave a link in the description. Now, I personally was not pierced with a gauged earring. I was, and that's because I was pierced out walmart with a gun when i was like 17 years old this labrite is gauged so that just means it's going to be a little bit trickier to put it in so here's the one again that i'm putting in it has a flat back and the top screws on and off so i'm just going to take it off of the pad before we get started do not do this over the sink because you will drop it down the drain with the braids you put them in through the back and then screw the front on so something that i personally like to do if i can't figure out the angle i used to do this all the time when i was changing other people's earrings to figure out the angle i would put it in through the front and then through the back or or if I'm putting in a regular earring, I would try to go through the back and then the front. So with the labray, the post is not sharp or anything. So you're pretty much just digging this thick post into your ear. What I like to do is take a regular earring. So I'm actually just going to take my hoop that I had in prior. And I'm going to put it through my hole. And this is going to be like a guide. I'm going to take my posts because remember it goes in through the back so i'm going to put the labray on the post once i find it and now i'm going to push it through There we go. Drop my earring. It's been a very long time since I put a thicker gauge in my ear. So doing it without the earring was just going to really hurt my ear. And I don't want to deal with that right now. So the little tiny piece then screws on. The piece is actually what has the thread. You just have to feel around for it. All right, so I can feel that it went in. I'm not letting go of the earring as I thread it on. So I'm going to hold on to the back of the post so that way as I screw, the post doesn't screw because then you're just going to be twirling both around. So you do have to hold on to the back of the post. So then I'm going to slowly turn to the right. Am I turning to the right? I'm turning to the left. So for this one, usually it's righty tighty, lefty loosey. But this one, I'm turning it to the left and it's tightening so that is what it looks like this one is pretty long so that is what it looks like in now i'm going to take it out and to take it out i'm going to unscrew it like i said usually it's lefty loosey righty tighty but when i was tightening it i tightened it to the left so now i'm going to unscrew it by going to the right if you have very sweaty or slippery hands then use gloves because gloves will just make it easier. So again, I'm going to hold on to the back. I'm not using my nails, I'm using my actual like fingers. I'm going to turn it to the right as I hold on to the back. So I'm turning it towards my face and there we go, it's out. I just pulled it out. I pulled the back out and the front came out also at the same time. Again, this is me just redoing a video from three years ago because the quality of the video wasn't that great. If you guys wanna see more piercing and jewelry videos, be sure to subscribe right here and check out more helpful videos right here. I will see you guys in my next video.